So this is Socky, and she is doing her learner's driver's test today. This is her dad, Justin. He passed his learner's driver's test first time, and he believes it's important to study for the test and get your learner's plates first try. This is me, Socky's mum. I refused to study for the test instead of hoping positive energy would get me through. Unfortunately, I failed the test too many times to count. Socky believes her personality is much more similar to her dad's, and when her older sister, Saber, pranked the family and pretended to fail her driver's test, both Socky and Justin were very disappointed in her. I just can't believe she failed because she obviously didn't practice enough. Yeah, you should have the just here on the website. So evidently, Socky has put herself in a high-pressure position in today's vlog. Will she pass her driver's test first time, or will she choke under the pressure? Ooh, driving test, yay. Will you pass it? First go, Sock? First go. Yeah. All I really want today is when Sadie did the driving test, she did to do it twice, and I want to do it the first time. Oh. That's, that's what I want to so. And how would you feel if you don't get it first time? Oh, very, very disappointed. <laughs> very. Why do you care? I don't know. It doesn't even matter. Into the future! Judging by Socky's face, does she look like a girl who passed or failed? To pass the test, you have to get everything right. I think you can get too wrong. <gasps> I feel like you put a lot of pressure on yourself. So me and Soggy actually have some long-standing beef about who is better at push-ups. Proper push-ups. Yeah. Like, push <laughs> Remember, I'm 40. How old am I? Very old. I'm like 80. Mum first. Okay, ready? Do you look at what she's taking? That was so insane. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Easy. It was easy. I have to warn you, in this next clip, Socky is going to be quite gassy. So I want you to concentrate on the strain. Sometimes Socky gets very cold, like, so I'm turning the air conditioning so much if you start to shake. Write the comment, who did the best push up? Oh, that one hurt me then. <laughs> you have to see what's happened in here. So our toilet, literally. That's where the toilet used to be in the basin. Had to get it all ripped out. And then all the toilet contents after the toilet explosion literally came out this side. We had to get this floor ripped up. Do you feel like we missed an opportunity to make a, our house flooded YouTube video? I had some really big news coming up and here's a clue about what it was. I didn't sleep in this house today. I slept in another house. Can you guess what the big news is? I asked Socky mm -hmm. who she thought she was most like, you or me. What do you reckon she said? Most like me. <laughs> <laughs> Socky, would you say you take after me or Papa? Papa. Oh. He's a big brain. <laughs> you see that cool little brain? Just because he nearly got 100 TR doesn't mean that I'm not as like street smart. You know? That's nice. Oh. But she's got to pick one of us, right? Are you happy for me? I'd be happy for you. <laughs> Socky's put a lot of pressure on herself right for this test. Mm. And I feel like if she fails it, she's going to be devastated. Yeah. So. If she does fail, she's going to be happy because when she comes home, we have a surprise for her, which is a new bedroom makeover. And like we've custom made a painting and it's, it's going to be wild. So I'm so excited. Either way, it's going to end happy. That's what I want this to do. Biggie and me are going to go for a walk. Do you think I'm going to crash? No. So Biggie and me are going for a walk. You know, for like good luck today, making sure I pass the driving test. Do you reckon we can get a chocolate croissant? Well, we're filming. <laughs> <laughs> What's that got to do with the answer? We're filming, so you have to be really nice. Socky, would you say you take after me or Papa? Papa. Okay, Socky, for sure. Whatever makes you feel happy. Quick, hang up before they change their mind. Okay, <laughs> oh, Got a W manipulation. Have you seen Biggie Short? You know I have this allergy to the cold. It's actually coming out pretty bad today. Maybe you can see it's like red on my arms. There. Don't tell Brooke, because I really want to swim at Bondi Icebergs when we move to Sydney. Oh, it's looking pretty bad now. Please write in the comments, because Papa thinks this is funny, and he didn't even tell me at the time what was happening, that he needs to go and get this checked out, because we all know when he had um, his operation, he had an allergic reaction to an aesthetic and ended up in ICU. Something really bad could happen from something like this. What do you rate your riz? What's the definition of riz? You don't know what riz is? No, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it now. It's just awkward. What is it? I don't know. It's like rizzing someone up. Like this. Hey. Oh, that's real. Oh, oh, that's real. So you got, you got good real. Yeah. Since we'll be us in Bondi, Biggie, we have to find the perfect chocolate croissant place at Bondi. If any of you like live near Bondi, comment like nice places to eat. I'll read every single one of them. I'm gonna walk past the place, looking like I'm really enjoying this. Okay, don't. That's so rude. Mm, this is so good. <laughs> <laughs> That's so mean. It's gonna be an unpopular opinion, but do you really think it's important to pass the driver's learner's permit test the first time? Well, I think it says something about you, so if you haven't passed it, that's fine, but I mean, I passed one first go, so. <laughs> but I didn't. What does it say about me, honey? I kind of think I'm better than you. <laughs>
I still love you though. So you probably think you're like a better driver than me, right? Yeah, I think I am. <laughs> you think you're better at like air hockey than me? I am. I feel like if you and me race driving, I reckon I could beat you. Uh -huh. Let's do it today. You versus me, go kart, man. My God, you'd be so butt hurt if you lost. <laughs> oh, I'd love to beat you. I'd never let you live it down. I wonder what's gonna happen there. It'd be like one of my old stories I tell, like when my grandma about the time like I was proved I was a better driver than you. Oh, Ooh, maybe do a little bit of a flash forward into the future. Into the future. Well, mum's going pretty well. Mum's catching up to Papa. I'm. Oh my gosh. Go, Papa. Mum's gone amazing! The real important question is, will you be in the car the first time I take the wheel? Yeah. Will you trust me or not? You'll be like, um, no. Disco yeah. met Champ for the first time! Yeah. Did you touch Champ? No, did you touch Champ? No, no. Good luck with your needle. Naz has been doing her hair and makeup for the last yeah. 20 minutes. <laughs> if you had to pick out of Sabre and Socky who's the best driver, who would you pick? I think Socky's gonna be the best driver. Socky. Both. Oh. Who do you reckon is the best driver out of me and Papa? Papa, Papa, for sure. Papa's the best driver of most people. Papa. We're gonna have a little bit of a face-off match. <laughs> and what's gonna happen if I beat him? Oh, oh, oh. I've got nothing to lose, man. You've right. got everything it's to lose. Right. Yeah. We'll do fastest lap. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's definitely, definitely, definitely Papa's gonna win that. You'd say I'm probably more intelligent than Papa. Mm. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, bro, you can still be better at air hockey, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Who had bigger brain, mama or papa? Mama. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, legends, it's time to go for my needles. I'm gonna hop in the car because I'm late for Flizzy. I've been having these needles in my arm for six months now to stop my allergies of dust mites, so Flizzy's right now driving me there. What? I said talk slowly. <laughs> oh my god. That's what his face is saying. Please, do you think Soggy's gonna pass their driving test today? I do hope so. Because I'd like someone to drive you around, not me. <laughs> so you're just trying to get rid of me? <laughs> well, I didn't say that exactly. <laughs> oh my god. How old are you when you got your driver's license? Exactly the right age. Mum wants me to iron my pants. I want to introduce you to my friend, Mr. Steamer. I iron Biggie's clothes. It takes time. And then he just throws them in his wardrobe and look how crinkled they are. So do you know what the lesson we're going to learn today, son? What? I'm going to teach you how to iron. And if you don't put clothes back that I iron, you're going to iron them. <laughs> God, you're awesome. Is it meant to steam like that? It's a steamer. That's its job. <laughs> Like that? <laughs> yes. I've never seen anyone use this technique before. I love how I'm over here to teach you a lesson how to do it and look who ends up doing it. <laughs> so I just want to get Nazzy to react to this video. Look at Biggie and... Oh, Naz! They're my shoes and they're ruined now. I was wondering why all the rhinestones were off it. <laughs> Please, it's like your, your favorite grandchild. Everyone wants to know. Um, 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 I can't tell you. <laughs> oh my God. This is like really messed up. <laughs> so take that as a yes. This is like a mess of the house. She does actually. Yeah. She always leaves those dog nets everywhere and then they stick on me. Now everyone, how much better does Biggie look? It don't Looks like your mummy loves you now. Okay, we're gonna go to the go kart. What are those? What are those? Okay, ignore everyone in the back, but I'm taking in charge of no statement and look how cool it is. So pretty as you can see, no statement. It's gonna be a really nice taking in charge and it's kind of gonna be a simple brand fashion label so you can make zero statements. Wait, I'm gonna show you something. I'm so excited that Socky to see a new bedroom. <gasps> no way! <laughs> gonna I don't know what you're gonna think of this. No, I'm not that massive. <laughs> yeah. Where's that gonna go? In her room. No, I can't go in her room. It fits. I measured it. Yeah. You're doing the bedroom makeover, just. Are you serious? That's not going you got to make it happen. What do you reckon it is? Something Socky will love. Then I've got a vision. You've got to execute. It doesn't. It's not. It's, it's science. It's gonna work. So we've got a lot of things to sort out today. Will Socky pass her driver's test? I present first time. Oh, and is Papa a better driver than me? Yes, yes. he is. Yes. 
<laughs> Papa's prize on the line. How surprised from one to ten would you be if I won? 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. Oh, wow. <laughs> from one to ten, Saber chose 100. <laughs> <laughs> Mum keeps lying to us and pretending because everyone's like, when did she have her first kiss? She keeps saying her Where's first this coming from, Dad? My first kiss was 30. <laughs> Mum, you keep saying it's Papa. Mom, well, that would make sense. Oh, that. <laughs> She had first kid when she was 18. 18? No, it was 12. 12. 12? Why are you trying to make it your thing, now? Why are you trying to rush it? Oh my god, I'm not! Make it special, now. That's why. found the special person. What? Oh my god, it's just a joke. Here we go. I'm going to prove you guys that I'm a new person. I am going to beat Socky. Okay, Naz, if you beat Socky, you can have your first kiss at 12. I can't be charged with that. Mom, I'll do it. <laughs> Mom, I just want to tell you. Surely someone believes that I can beat Papa. I think I know someone. Your imagination. <laughs> you can beat Papa if he crashes. <laughs> Mom, help. Mom, please help me. This is weird. I understand what this means to me. I beat him. Yeah, it's crazy. Seriously, if I beat him. Mum, you going to do a surgery or something? Mine looks like a butcher. Just, yeah. Like, Best time for one lap wins, okay? Papa's and Mama's go karts ready. Mum's doing stretches over there. Papa's super chill. I'm gonna, beat him. I'm gonna beat him. I'm just gonna make sure no sabotaging is going on. Good luck, you two. Papa's definitely winning. There's no chance of Mum winning. Hey, Papa. Good luck. Go, Mum. You can do it. Whoa, Mum, careful. I'm kind of worried about Mum because I feel like Mum would just get super excited about the race, and Mum doesn't have the best back, so if she like crashes. It could be really actually bad. Right now we have two donuts absolutely racing. Well, mom's going pretty well. Mom's catching up to Papa. I'm oh my gosh. Mom is going very fast. <laughs> Maybe I was wrong. Do that! Go, Pop! Go, Pop! You can do it! Mom's going amazing! I think there's two more competitive parents than my parents. They love competitions and they love to beat each other. Yeah, Mom! Jeez, I'm kind of worried. <laughs> I just don't want any of them to crash. <laughs> I'm just getting worried. Go, Pop! I reckon Mum might win. Yeah, Pop! Oh my gosh! I hope she doesn't kill us off. Yellow flag. So excited to see their scores. Oh, who won? Oh my god, Papa beat Mum by two seconds. So close. That's two seconds. I'm ready! I think I'm definitely going to win if you beat me. My fastest lap, I'll give you 200 V-Bucks. 200 dollars worth of V-Bucks. Wow. <laughs> He's definitely winning it now. If Sabe wins, I'm gonna buy her a Prada. But they underrate you. This is your moment to prove. What an X Games at skateboarding. You've been like the best surfer ever. You can do it. You show them that you can beat them. They don't believe you can. You've got this. Can the 14 year old boy beat his 43 year old mom? Oh, Socky looks good. You can do it, say. <laughs> At the start, she was looking terrible, but I feel like she's got a lot. One lap. Biggie's down five. After watching Sam on the track, I feel like it's like the best for society for her to get in her peace. <laughs> Drone footage by Pop. If Biggie doesn't beat me, it's going to be so sad for him. That's a finish and they're gonna find out what order they got. There's a lot on the line. A Prada bag, V bucks, 200 bucks worth. So let's go see who won. First, Biggie. Socky was second. Nazi third. Sabre fourth. But Biggie, did you beat my best time? No. No, I didn't. Oh. When Socky's away doing her permit test, we're gonna surprise her with a bedroom makeover. <gasps> oh my gosh, she's gonna love that. Yeah, so just in case she fails. Yeah, that'll she's be a nice thing. Yeah. Okay, yeah. right, cool. Who do you reckon won? And Sabre. <laughs> no, no. He was more of a roadblock than anything else. I'm so proud of the Norris. That's how all great sports encourage each other. Good job, guys. Love you guys. <laughs> That's where Sabre did her first actual drive. That's where Sophie can go today, maybe. Oh my goodness. She's going. Oh, but she's going. I've actually had a bit of a change of heart about actually moving out in Bondi. I don't think you ever even explained to people that you wanted to move out. Because, like, up to a couple of days ago, like, I really wanted to move out. Then I actually thought about it. I was like, Hamburger, cheeseburger, Big Mac, Whopper. Because she watched the horror movie. That's what happened. <laughs> <laughs> so I actually watched the movie, say. Kind of, yeah. She watched Home Alone. <laughs> <laughs> but say, but you always have a, a bed at our house. It's a very little one. Oh! And lucky enough, there's the Bondi backpackers down the road. You can always sleep in Or you can live in the oven or the cupboard. No, say, but there's always a space for you at home. They're always. I just feel like 18's very young. Doesn't mean you take the, the bang of room. Like Who's gonna tell Poppy on me? Yeah, it's you, can't, you can't do that. It's hard. That's
Because like if we're renovating the house, we can't really renovate it for like yeah. everyone gets a bedroom. Yeah. And then you just leave after a month because then that doesn't make sense. And that's not really <laughs> like big. Well, we originally bought the house to accommodate every single kid. No, we but if you're moving out two months after that, so say, but there a was a problem. The house didn't have it's a laundry. Not really it's not very big. Right? What well, about if Sava's gonna move in for like two months and move out, should she get like the big room, put all her stuff in yeah. it? Yeah. And then I was telling you off camera, there was a huge thing that happened we just haven't told you about yet. That kind of all comes into play with Sava's dilemma. Oh, there's a clue! It's a bit of a, yeah, it's a kind of a cryptic clue. So, but it doesn't help at the start. Socky oh, driver's it? license permit test is in 30 minutes. So what? Sort this all out now oh, and just explain. Right now. Calm down. Just to explain, I don't even know if what we were talking about in the car makes sense, but Saber. <laughs> Why is she dying over me? I just got a notification from my Apple Watch saying that I was in too loud of an environment. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone says they find us in the shops because we're so loud. <laughs> so what happened was Sabre wanted to test what it was like to move out. And so she's been living at Fliz's house. Mm. And I really enjoyed it. <laughs> She's just I, I see you guys single day all day. Yeah. I just pretty much sleep there from six to like seven. So Sable wants to be a YouTuber, so she wants to work with us. But if we're together all the time and then at the night time too, it's just a bit too much. So Sable being able to go to Flizzies and having her own space. I've really enjoyed that, but I think to making the next step to moving out and being my own apartment is really scary for me. But the problem is Sable told us that she wanted to move out yes. off camera. Yeah. And she was dead certain about that. So is it just because you watched that horror movie yeah. now you don't want to move out? We just need to give her some sort of yeah, romantic yeah. comedy to watch yeah. and then she'll like want to move out again. About like this girl like ran off into a unit and then this hot boy <laughs> was secretly like under the lounge the whole time. Maybe the hot boy didn't want to date the girl who was living with her parents still but she just wanted to date the other girl who was like independent. <laughs> really important to me and Papa that you always feel like you have that a place with us. I think moving in Bonner, there's a lot more people there and we sometimes get hassled out, so we need to find a really secure apartment. But also, we've got something sorted for me moving out in 19, which I have with. You can't talk about that yet. The solution that we thought, but there's problems to it, is Sabre could live in the attic space. We could make it really cool, but the door for the attic is through Socky's room. It's fair enough though, Socky wouldn't want me to like live there. I wouldn't want to. But either. you don't have to live there forever. No. It's just till you find somewhere that you feel safe. Basically, it is forever. So then Socky said, I don't want the room with the ensuite, and I want the room with the ensuite. And I want too. Yeah, but that, like, Papa, you're 12. You're 12. You're like no, but Sophie doesn't want it. No, I, I do want it. Oh. But that means I have to share a room with Sabre for a year while she tries to find this magical apartment. It's not going to happen. Yeah, no. Sabre, how much? long do you want to be at home <laughs> for? But then we put a time limit on Sabre. That's yeah. also really mean. Yeah. And just like you can just make bad choices. No, but think, also, I can't. No, I mean. I think if the right apartment comes up where they've actually, like, it's not like a free for all where people can come inside the building. When did you. Do you get your first kiss now? It's like, you usually get when over did it. You? I told you. Mom, it was Mom, what are you putting in the sleep? Mom, you told me at 12. That's what you, Mom said she had a first kiss. I did not have a first kiss at 12. Alright, well, I'm going to have my first kiss at 12 and let that sit in your feet. Now, if I say to you, you can have your first kiss at 12, you're going to do whatever you want to do either way. <laughs> so, why do you care what I say? Because I feel like if I did have my first kiss and I didn't have your blessing or permission, I feel like that'd be wrong. <laughs> really? Blessing? Do you know what my mum told me about my first kiss? I'm not gonna say when I had it, but mum said it's the most special moment and you two people connect and instead it was this slobbery, gross, teeth biting. You had it with Ooh. the wrong person then. What if I met the right person? And like Ooh. I was like, How did you meet the right person? No, I haven't met, met anyone. Mm. Is that the one with the... Oh. Look at Biggie. It's true. He's <laughs> red ass. It's true. Look at him. Do you believe in kissing someone on the first day? Yeah. What do you, do you think? Like 
if you're like 40, you're going to do a lot on your first date, I would say. Or it depends what? who you are because some of us have standards, Justin. <laughs> Wait, if, I want, if you're 40, I feel like you should do nothing. What do you want? I'm 40, like your last one's all cut off by then. Mass reckons anyone who's old, they should ban from like any intimacy. So he's like, Fuck, it's time for your big moment. Do you think you can pass first go? I hope do I you want to quickly do one quick test? Yes. Okay. Go. Okay. The screen recording. Headphones on. Let's go. Your speed. Under good conditions when driving behind any vehicle at any speed, you should. <laughs> this is a bit much. Stop. <laughs> Guys. Another vehicle requires good concentration and judgment. Which of the following statements is correct? Stop! Oh, I feel so proud of ourselves. Like, we've totally abducted Zoki. Mum, we abducted her. What about the secret thing? Oh, God, I can smell what? everyone's like after lunch press. Yeah, I know, it's true. Come closer. Okay, <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do is, when I've taken Socky for the test, you guys <laughs> keep it for the bedroom. Okay, so I bought everything. It's going to be so cool. It's so exciting. But what about the secret? Tell me the secret item. No, no. I know the secret item. But you haven't seen it. I have seen it. Oh, there you go. She's oh, seen, it. seen it. Describe it to me. Don't, don't. Wait. <laughs> this is Saki's new sheets. No, it's not going to help. Yeah, they're great help. Thank okay. you. For it. Okay. Do we have a last minute crammer? Saki, it's time. For what? Your test. No, no, no. No, we used to do that. And if you fail first time, we know that you think oh. people who fail first time are no good like me mm -hmm. and your sister. Yeah. So, I'm oh, worried maybe I will all fail the first time, but it's all for fun. Do you reckon Socky's gonna fail? Yeah. Oh! Just before Socky goes, can you tell her how disappointed her you'd be if she fails? Don't do anything to our family now. Socky, if you come back here the first time, like, Papa, 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 you know what lesson you'd be like? He would. He wouldn't say anything, but he would. You know he would. And there's nothing wrong with failing, is there, Sam? Did you get 100% on your test? Yeah, I think I did in the learners. Oh, we're gonna do it. If you fail, you'll be a disappointment to everyone. <laughs> 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 okay, she's gone, she's gone. Quick, everyone, upstairs now. What we're gonna do is I think we're gonna rip all Sookie's like old sheets off. Her carrot friends and her. I hate doing this stuff. I hate making pets too. No, but it'll make Sookie happy. What's oh, doggos? Even if she has a fail today, I think she's gonna be so much happier when she sees this room makeover. It's gonna be the best. Let's go! Oh, like all my trash talk I shouldn't have said. <laughs> I feel like Papa and me have like a secret connected note. And he so will be disappointed yeah. in oh, you. It'll, it'll be broken forever. Yeah. Oh, it will be it. broken yeah. forever. I'm not teasing right now. Oh, you guys, we're going to get the pants. We're losing Biggie, great. Whoa. Just in case you didn't know, Soggy loves her bed sheets so much with camera that she even lets dogs rip them off. Maybe oh, Soggy got a bit hungry, so eating the carrot. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone, let's go in the pony. Are you able to carry it? Painting? You don't know how painting? big this painting is. It's giant. It's, it's like, like a, it's like a bigger than the wall. That's why I said Mum doesn't know science. It's not going to fit. All right, she's going in now. We're here. Good luck, don't let us down. <laughs> Bye. Okay. All right, quick, we haven't got long. Quick, run, 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 run. That's your fault. You didn't bring your ID. Is it my fault? In. That's your fault. Yes, it is your fault. Is it? Your I fault. would love to know what you think about that in the comments. Is it my fault that Socky wasn't organised? Please tell me. 
Okay, nice nuts. A message from mum. Socky's forgotten her passport and her <laughs> Medicare card, everything she needs for her ID. So I better go run it down okay, to her, okay? Don't, don't let me in the room. Mum, it's your job to tell me if I need. You didn't even know. Who you didn't even know? You didn't even say about Like, of course, like, you would just say, I'm not seeing the test, man. <laughs> no, but I just did the practice and you just take me and do it. Like, I don't know I need anything. Like, that's, that's your, as a parent and the guardian of me, you have to make sure I prepare. <laughs> It's already filled out. Socky feels like if she fails, then you're gonna no, always look at it. No, it's just a joke. It's fine, Socky. It's yeah. just like I don't care how you go. Socky says she looks so nice. Hello, Socky cares more. I wish he's better than her, so I'm right. into it. That's nice. Look at what Socky's got next to a bedside table. It's a picture of all of us. It's all about to happen, and I love that they've got that congratulations sign just there. Will you be congratulated today, Socky? <laughs> Now that Socky's bed is all done and beautiful, we just need to like get the painting and in And Winky's bed looks so cute! Whoa! It looks great! Guys, we got to get the picture now! Let's get the picture, let's go! I don't know how we're going to put it up there. It's back here, she has started her test. So here's the Whoa. painting, oh my god. So mum's showed me where it was, but I have never actually seen it. Wow. <laughs> Through the door. Sorry, update. I just heard like a ding ding and I think it was Socky. She must have to ding a ding for someone to come and check and there's a lady who's going over there right now to check on her. If you listen, she did it. This is not going to fit through the door and things like, what are they up the top there? Uh, I reckon if we manifest, it will. How are you gonna get upstairs? I think upstairs is gonna be not too bad. We can just get around this corner. Do you think Mum even thought it was how it's gonna be on the wall? <laughs> is it gonna work or not? Oh wow! Oh Whoa. my god! Hundred <laughs> percent. You know what we should do? Prank everyone and say you failed. Ready? Smooth it out of way. That's <laughs> <Sorry. Wow. laughs> Okay. <laughs> Stop. I'm so sorry. sorry. Too happy. Part of the Aussie culture is to support other Aussies, and this is artwork by Jessie. This isn't a paid ad or anything like that. We just love what she does. She could have a painting, but she could never use a garbage again. <laughs> it's such a nice bedroom she's got now. Look at you. Let's get ready for her. Let's go. I'm so proud of you. So happy. Well, thank you. <laughs> Papa's gonna be so stoked. But what's he gonna do when he finds out you failed? That's what looks so good. Look at Nancy's painting. Can't wait for your art gallery and Saber's art gallery in Bondi. That'd be sick. Mm, art gallery? I thought, oh, we're just gonna start from the market. I mean, should we make a Norris Nuts art gallery? That'd be so cool. Soggy's here, Soggy's here. She's home! Just pretend you actually failed. I'm Oh, I already know what happened. Just by looking at her face. Okay, so okay. what actually happened for real, I did the test and I failed, but they said I could do it again, but... <laughs> <laughs> and, but I didn't want to do it because I want to practice a bit more because I, I felt really embarrassed. I think you're very good, so... That's yeah, that's the case. Well, we have something to cheat up. Pork. That's okay, so... You are really good, 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 but I just like... Yeah, they always put that... Don't tip it, this. <laughs> you got a disc? No, that's good so it's fine. Oh! Whoa! Oh, I received a gift! I received a gift! Oh, wow! Yay! Love you! Thank you. And there's one more surprise sock. What? Come this way. <laughs> close, your close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Three, two, one. <laughs> Maybe someone in the family didn't calculate how big it was. <laughs> I love that one. Thanks, Aww. Dad. Everyone's so nice. I just wish I could have done it. And I could come back to visit and be happy. Mm. Don't worry. It's not like it's not life and death. Mm. Oh no, he's a prank. <laughs> 